Hi, I'm David Dutton, and welcome to Behind the Scenes of Kill Phil. Uh, this week was a lot of fun, and a lot of it was due to Mari. I mean, she's just hilarious, and she just goofed off the entire time on set. With the gravity gun, I could probably pick up this car and shove it in your face. Jesus. <laughs> gravity gun, pinchers go up, energy bolts come out, and you lift stuff up. Yeah, defy gravity, get bitches. <laughs> We're friends. Uh, I've known her for a while, and she's actually danced in a few music videos I've done before. Um, try to find her. That was creepy, actually. <laughs> Camera, speak. One more. Right. Try to overact to this one, dude. All right. Oh, that, I was trying to act my least. <laughs> I didn't know how Rick and Mari were going to interact together, but they turned out to be great on set. I mean, they were just goofing off together the entire time. It was it was pretty fun to watch. Take one. Drop that beat, DJ. I'm going to need that plutonium right away. All right, I'll go fly into North Korea for you. Go undercover. Actually, maybe I don't really have to go undercover. All I need is one of those police girl outfits and then just do this robotically, you know? All right. That gnome was from my mother's secret garden! You might no be able to find way. another one in the white forest. That's right, right? What? White forest? Oh, where did the gnomes come from? In Half-Life, right? Is it the white forest? Oh, I don't know what forest it is. <laughs> <laughs> I, well, she's, kind of, she's kind of a major. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, that's good. That's still good. Still We're still rolling. Right, and action. I think that's the right realm. Bitch, go wild! Whoa! Okay, good. <laughs> Just kill Phil. <laughs> So our VFX on this weapons test was really old school. Um, we really just tied string to everything and just made it float by hand. Okay, cut. Charlie. One more. I think I'm, I'm gonna disrupt it a little when it goes up. No, no. The problem there was the string was really weak and it kept breaking on us. And sometimes we put the object in front of a green screen and then we just keyed it out and we would attach it and motion track it to the actual gun. All right, so here's the basics on the gravity gun. So let's start off by combining our two shots. We have this cup shot and the shot with Mari and Rick. And then we have some electricity, really it's advanced lightning and after effects. We pick its origin, destination, then we track the center of the gun. And that way, we can use that data to later grab hold of the cup and keep it in line with that. But also for now, we're going to use it so that the direction of this electricity will attach to that. And so for every frame, the electricity will know where to go next, so they're all in perfect center alignment. But you can see the origin at the tips, we're losing that, so we're going to have to track those tips. Uh, lucky for us, Rick painted those uh, orange so that we can track the data. And so we put the tracker just inside range of the orange, and there it goes, it's not slipping. And we get that data, and now we attach the origin electricity, and you can see they're not slipping, they're hanging there. Uh, for the energy ball, we have a solid, circular solid that's fluctuating in size, and then we have an optical flare, and it's flickering in brightness. We'll also put in some core kits from Action Essentials. It'll add in some smoke, real debris, real spark, and add in some life to an otherwise all CG generated effect. So we take that energy ball and attach it to the center position data. Also we take smaller energy balls and attach it to the tips. For the cup, let's go ahead and mask it out and we're going to make a still out of this cup. And this is when the gravity gun pulls um, the objects into its tractor beam. So we have the cup there, it gets yanked in, and now it's following the gravity gun because it's attached to that original center tracking data for the position. Stop! What are you doing? Okay. So, bing, bing. Stop. For the ricochets, we just blew dust off with an air gun and kind of just knocked things around a little. Hold your end position longer. Yeah. Okay. No. Do, you, do you want me to do the slide? No, don't do that because I'm I'm sliding you. So okay. actually, at the end, the, the more still you are, the, uh, the better or easier time I'm gonna have in post. Okay. Ready, set, saw. Oh, poor Phil. He'll never learn. Oh. All right. Well, that's about it, and we'll see you next week. So remember, next week we're doing Dead Space and we're going back to Prop Master Dragon's workshop. So remember to subscribe so you know when the next video comes up and we'll see you next week. Get your film fix. Subscribe to Cinefix.